Hello, my future RN friends. Once again, this is Beth of Reality Life Series. And in this video, I will be answering some questions. Who wants to know if there is a calculator provided during the ATIT's exam? Yes, the answer is yes. There is going to be a, a four-function calculator that will be provided. You don't need to bring one, but there's going to be a calculator provided. So what is the calculator look like? So when I go to Google Images, you will see the type of calculator that is being provided to you on your exam. This is what the calculator looks like in your ATIT's exam. I'm on the ATIT's assessment website. So this is um, for sure the one that you're going to use when you're taking the online version of the test. So for me personally, when I took the T's exam, I never clicked on the first four functions which are the m plus m minus mrc and mc the only functions that i used was this in the yellow one and the yellow green and the blue one okay to further explain this we have the first one on the left yellow um, block is the percent and then next is c which is clear and ce is it goes it goes the same thing with c which is clear and then the last one the arrow to the left it means delete or backspace and then the next yellow down below the arrow is um, division and then multiplication and then subtraction and then the bottom yellow is the addition and then let's go over to the green, yellow green color this is the equal sign okay let's go to the one that's highlighted with um, light blue so those are the numbers from 0 to 9 and then this little thing it's the dot which is under number 2 below number 2 is the decimal point or period and then below number 3 that's the square root so how to use the square root function if you are asked to find the square root of 16 then um, i would go ahead and try uh, 1 6 and then click the square root or vice versa or you can click the square root first and then 16 it depends on you know how it functions because some calculator is different like sometimes you have to enter the the square root first and then the number or number first and then the square root sign and then it should give you the answer right there on the top right as you can see there's like zero in there that means the calculator is be not being used so if you press any function in this calculator um, numbers or function should appear on the top right on the very top of your calcula calculator screen so i hope this is helpful to you guys and best of luck on your atit's exam once again this is beth from reality life series trying to help you pass your atit's exam good luck and if you have any questions please feel free to message me or comment to me down below and i will be glad to answer all your questions have a nice day bye